Hello, and welcome back to another episode of The Binding of Isaac. In this episode, we will not be as Azul, hopefully. Oh, I should have been Isaac, actually. Maggie. I hate you, Maggie. Maggie, not not a nice character for me. Very, very slow. And Azazel being very fast and flying. This is going to be a difficult change for me. Oh, is she so slow? This play is Isaac. It was an Isaac run anyway. I was not having any of that. Okay. Cannot play as Maggie after playing as Azazel. Especially not with that being my first item. In case you don't know, that bean is a spacebar item and once per room or a few rooms, however long charges, you get to fart. You get to press spacebar and fart. Oh, and I forgot I can fly. Glad I didn't take damage there. I'm surprised I didn't take damage. I was just walking into a rock while the fly came to kill me. And I can't kill you, thank you. Right, let's find the item room. I hope you're not that bean, although, you know, maybe I haven't picked it up yet, and maybe I'll never see it again. Who knows, maybe I just ruined my life. Who knows. Okay. So, we start off with Gluttony. That's not too bad a fight. Hopefully he drops uh, something nice. He can just drop random red health, and he can drop a very nice health up. Uh, I mean, it's nothing too special about the health up, but it does refill your health. Which later in the game can be a lifesaver, and in one of my runs would have allowed me to win if I had not died in the previous room. That envy filled room, if you know the one I'm talking about. Good for you for watching my videos and paying attention and remembering them for later when I reference them. Okay. Let's find that item room. Sure, they can't be too much further. Ah, I was right. So it's not free that man until I have to. Uh, probably the best thing to do is keep them at a distance. Look at what my range is, and it's pushing further and further away. So I can't hit him. Yep. But that's alright. So that sleeping man in there, he's going to chase me, I believe. Because his eyes are closed, that means he has power. Yep, when he gets close, he opens his eyes and charges. Magnet. I hate magnet, but let's do it. Um, just for the money in that one room. <laughs> Nothing else. I'm sure it will come in handy. There's always lots of items to grab. Usually money and stuff. Um, because he was a a kind of a boss version of a guy. I lost the whole spirit out, which kind of sucks. But let's blow this one up and yeah, I got it back. Cool. So this room kind of just did nothing at all. I don't waste the bomb. Essentially this bomb lost me a bomb, but then I gained it back, so essentially this room just didn't exist. So we look at it. And that poop didn't exist. Nothing exists. There is only me. I am just sitting in a, in a foam room in space, going, video games, video games, video games. So that there is. Gemini. How I hate your greenness. Why are you so green? You're not attached, for one thing. That's terrifying. This man is following me. Because you're not attached. And you're green. I think all that's different about you is the fact that you're not, not attached. Which is interesting. It doesn't change much. Changes it a little bit. I, I can see it getting quite annoying in certain situations. But it also means that when you're sitting there, I can just freely shoot you. Because there isn't a guy shooting back at me. So in some ways it makes you easier. This is not a guy you want knocked back for. Oh, he is annoying. It's just how unpredictable he is. It's horrible. Best thing you can do about this guy is not shoot him. Makes him a lot more predictable. Because the knockback... Mm, knockback on this guy is just so annoying. Like, stop. And why didn't you bounce that time? You know, I was, I was expecting him to bounce because he bounced every single other time. This guy's annoying. Oh, I got range up, that's nice. <clears throat> that, kids, is why you don't want any knockback ever. Enemies like that are just so frustrating. 
I don't think you understand how annoying they are until you have played this game. Just how random their movement is. And they get so close to you because he's homing, as they usually are, and then he just bounces randomly when you hit him. Because usually you hit people to knock them away so they don't kill you, but that guy, you can't because he'll either knock him into you or away from you, you never know. And you can't just not shoot him because... Huh? Cool. You can't just not shoot him because he's homing and he'll kill you. Now Boomerang Tears, that's nice. Got it last run, but it didn't do anything really. Uh, it's a pretty rare item, I'm surprised to see it twice in a row, but hey. Can't complain. Can't complain about that though. That was complete and utter cow poop. Uh, hopefully it gets a lot more damage. My damage right now is disappointing to say the least. <laughs> but this is nice. Oh. Thank you. <laughs> uh. It's pretty nice. Oh. Thank you. And now we have. Kill him like an Australian. Oops, I hit your friend. And then it's coming around here. What do I mean? I mean like a boomerang, but this is a mirror, Ashley. Your joke didn't even make full sense. Whatever. It was a simile, not a metaphor. Metaphor is stupid, by the way. Similes are life. Um, I'm not sure if I want this. I'll save you. I'll save you. I mean, of course I want it, but I'm not sure if I want it now, you know. These guys are also random movement, although they don't get as close to you as the other guys, so it's not nearly as frustrating. They're also a lot weaker and die off, thankfully. Hello, flies. You fools. Yeah, you know, I like mirror tears, though. They're nice, especially if you get uh, piercing tears. Um, because then you can kill people multiple times with the same shot. Which is always that, you know, you shoot through them and then it comes back and hits them again. Just kill this guy. Get deal with the devil or angel or whatever and then pick up that spirit out. Or, because I didn't pick up the spirit out, I won't get a deal with the devil and or angel. Okay, I should be killing him, not just sitting here. But at the same time... Now, this guy and his zooming, he's just like Goody Jr., he's got to learn how to defeat them. Now, my range is pretty terrible right now because of my reflection. It seems to, like, almost half your range, I'd say. My tears don't get anywhere, so I hope, hopefully it doesn't end up like... Oh! What? Ah! That was just annoying. I don't know why he didn't hit me the first time, and I don't know why he bounced over there the second time. Oh well. Yeah, whatever. He's got to treat him like Gertie Jr. and he's not too bad. Never be fooled into their, their dodging patterns. They're misleading. Aha! Poop. Oh! I suppose I say your worst enemy is, is yourself, but... Man. Uh huh. Like, 